Hello, um, in this video, I want to explain how to integrate Loibas and Google Sheets. And as an example, in this video, I will export Loibas receipts in Google Sheets automatically. Uh, before starting this process, please create your Loibas account, make account, and Google account. And in Loibas account, please uh, activate integration subscription before start. If you don't have an account with Loibas or Make, please please make up uh, sign up from the link below. Okay, so now let's start. The goal of this video is to set up uh, the integration that automatically exports receipts from Google button, Google Sheet. Let's go to the make and create a new scenario. So by using make, you can create your own integration without using any real code. So now let's search for Loibus. And if you click Loibus, you will see this menu that uh basically this is what what kind of action you can do about robots on make platform for this case um, i will choose what's receipt it means whenever i create a new receipt in robots uh, make will be triggered and get the date of this receipt yes so by clicking here I can connect my Loibas account, Loibas account to make. So let's click and OS20, which is recommended, and save. Now this new screen appears that's asking for permission that make can uh, get the information from your Loibas account. Click allow. And here, I choose create, it means it will be triggered when I create a new receipt in Europe. And with store ID. Okay. And start from now on. Okay. So, next step, I will connect my Google Sheet to this make platform. To do so, I will click this plus button and search for Google Sheets. Click Google Sheets and this time I will choose other row and click connect to my Google account. Yes. And because this is uh, my uh, Google Street name, I will look for it here. And sit then, sit one. Okay, let's. I will click OK for now. Okay, now on my Google Sheet, I prepared what kind of information I want to get from my receipt. So, in this case, I will choose receipt number, receipt date and time, then I can include it the total amount and payment type. Of course, if you want more information, you can add uh, more columns here, such as employee name, customer name, and so on and so on. But to simplify this video, I choose just only five information. 
Now let's go back to Merrick. On the Google C setting, there's a place that I map my data from Roybus to Google Sheet. So now, uh, column A is a receipt number. So I choose receipt number here. Next, receipt date and time. So I will choose uh, receipt date. Column C is items included. So here I will choose line items and click item name. Of course, you can also choose variant name, but let's click item name here. And total, total I choose total money. Payment type is uh, from here payments and name. And click OK. And here click on so that oops, I save and click on. So actually in this, by this steps, uh, you are, it's already done that whenever you have a new receipt, uh, this receipt will come to Google Sheets. It's already done, so it's very quick. Now let's try to create a receipt in my Rollbus account. I made this save with a chat card. And I click run. So now my data, let's uh, data is already in this Google feed. So it's very quick and you don't need any programming. You can do many things, not only Google Sheets, not only Rivers. Um, so very, this is very recommended for many people and to reduce cost for IT. Thank you.